Hello everybody, Tim Norris here, aka Grey Elephant. And Carmen Norris. And welcome to a live playthrough by Grey Elephant Gaming. What are we playing today? Today we're playing History of. That's right, and this was sent to us by Asmodee North America, and we're going to sit down, we're going to play head to head, and see who can put on the best show for the king. Whether he's happy or he's sad, angry or mad, bad to put Whatever on the best show. Whatever pleases the king. All right, everybody, here we are. We're going to play some History O, and this is designed by Bruno Cathala and Christian Martinez. The artwork is by Jeremy Fleury. I, I hope I pronounced that right. Fleury. 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 <laughs> um, beautiful artwork in this game, and I wanted to make sure I mentioned the artist because, wow, it is just absolutely stunning, the artwork. All right, let's talk about the game itself a little bit. So the game plays a little bit different for two players than it would if we had three or four players. And and, and what I mean by that is, is that Carmen and I will be responsible for our own deck, and then we're also going to have an NP deck. And I'll explain how that works as we're uh, here in just a minute. So what we have out here are eight total locations. Carmen and I both have eight total cards in our hand, one card to match each location. Her and I are going to select the card secretly and place it face down. What we're going to do is we're going to try to visit these locations, and what we want to do is either take advantage of either an event, gain an actor, or possibly gain an acrobat. Actors work in that they can influence the king. Um, the king, at the, this moment, he wants a happy play. We know that because right here on our little meter, it's on the happy side, and there's the rabbit on the front. The rabbit signifies happy. The stork signifies tragedy or sad. So whenever the meter goes to the sad side, we flip that over and it'll be a sad play. So we want to try to get actors that are going to coincide with what kind of mood the king's in. The mood is set by this meter up here. So right now he wants a happy play. So if we look here, we've got a lot of tragedy ones. Mm -hmm. We do have one happy one. Now each of these actors will have um, uh, abilities that they can perform as well. We don't necessarily need to go over each one of those individually right now. But just know that, um, for instance, like he can steal coins and uh, he can gain back your carvel and your cards you played. There's a lot of different abilities. The acrobats will be played face up in front of you. They can be used once each season, and there will be a total of two seasons per round. Or, I'm sorry, it's a total of two seasons per entire game. Mm -hmm. At the end of the second season, the game ends. Um, one round, we'll play our card. Wherever we go, then we'll place our little carvel up there to signify that we've already been there. We'll discard that card. Then what's going to happen is we're going to put in a whole other set of cards down, and they can even stack. So we could even have three or four cards in one spot at, at, at certain points in time. But the problem is, if your carvel's up there, you can't go there. Exactly, because they know that you've already been there, so you can't go back. So the way that it works with the NP player in a two-player game is that we basically, Carmen and I will just look at the top card and we say, okay, that's where this character's going to go. So we've got a little bit of information where we know where this character's going to go. We don't necessarily want to go to the same place. The reason you don't necessarily want to go to the same place with another player is because you won't gain any of the cards. They'll be discarded. Anytime actor cards are discarded, then they will affect the mood of the king. So if, for instance, he is a level one actor, tragedy, that would move this little meter one space over towards the tragedy side, and it would change and influence the king's mood. Now he wants a tragedy play. You would also, instead of gaining any of the cards that are here, you would gain a secret request card. These are cards that give you bonuses that you could play at the end of each season that can give you bonus coins. Coins are how you win the game. Whoever has the most wins. All right, I covered the basics of this. Why don't we just get started playing? Carmen and I are now going to take a moment. We're each going to look at our cards. We're going to look at all the cards that are out here. We're going to each select one secretly. Plus, we're going to select um, the secret location where uh, each one of our MP players are going as well. And when we come back, we'll each uh, reveal where we're going, and we'll explain what the actions of those, what that means. Okay, so we've each selected our cards, so we will now reveal. I am going to go to the number three with blue. White is going to number eight. Carmen, she is going to number six. And, oh, you stinker. Her uh, MP player is going to three. So now what we do is we just set our little carvels down here at the bottom of the board to show where our characters are going. We now discard these cards because uh, basically we can't use those. Now we will get those back, but we'll explain when we Eventually. get them back. Yeah. 
All right, so here's what we do now. We go, we start at one and we work all the way up to eight. So nobody's here, bam, two players are here. So what happens with this in this case is that this card gets discarded. Both of our carvels will go up here. So now we know that neither, uh, the, you know, I can't go there nor Carmen's MP player can go there. I will gain a secret request card. And that, that's kind of what these look like. And this tells you when they are played. So, hmm, interesting. Okay, so now it goes up to Carmen, and Carmen has gained herself an acrobat. Now, what's that acrobat do? This is a chameleon. Uh, you can act as a comedian or a tragi tragedian mm -hmm. <laughs> um, at the end of the season. It doesn't actually get you coins, but it helps you to uh, win ties, basically. Exactly. So now, the NP player, basically, we just discard that card. It goes away, and then his little... Too. It was a good card, and uh, I wanted to actually go there, but I knew that he was, so there was no purpose to me mm. trying. So now what we do is we put a new card out in each location. And as you can see, like I was telling you, they'll begin to start stacking in uh, areas. I mean, we could have up to like four cards in some areas. It gets all kinds of crazy. Hey, all right. So it looks like we got a couple of other acrobats coming out here. So why don't we check them out? So we've got a turtle. What's the turtle do? During the travel phase, choose your card after the other players have revealed theirs. Oh, so you can let everybody reveal where they're going and then you choose yours after. That's really powerful. So the rooster? Before totaling the ikus, you can discard one of your actors without changing the king's mood. Okay, so what that means is, is that whenever you acquire an actor, you can, if you want, discard the actor immediately to affect the king's mood. You can change that if you like. All right, so now we're going to go back to the traveling phase. We're going to each start selecting a card. We'll be right back. All right, so we're back, and let's see what Carmen went. She green player is going to six. She is going to seven. The white player is going to one, and I am going to five. So we all picked different locations. <laughs> that was great. I so. get my stuff I want to <laughs> So uh, we do start here, and then we work up again. So starting here with the one, both of these are just going to be discarded. Now, typically, if they were discarded with two players, then uh, it would affect the king's mood. It does not work that way when it's just the NP player. Next, uh, we go to me. So I will gain tippy turtle so uh that will be something that what i can do is i can use that once per season so i usually use something like that whenever uh, it's like okay when is it most beneficial obviously mm -hmm. uh now i also have a tragedian i could keep him or i could discard him to affect the king's mood by four towards the tragedy side not necessarily a bad idea given the fact that you know if i wanted if i had more tragedians and i wanted to have a tragedy uh play I'd possibly do that. Right now, I don't think it's important. All right, so the MP player has went here, so the rooster is going to go away. That was a good card, That too. was a really good one, I know. And then Carmen is going to gain two money for that event. And then here's the really cool part. This actor right here, she can keep it if she wants. Now, if she decides to discard it, she can influence the king's mood one space happy. But this this uh, bunny has a little uh, action as well that he does. What this allows Carmen to do is that she gets to take back all of her cards that she has discarded, her location cards, see, so she gets all those back. And she gets back all her carvels that, that were up there. So that is really, really, really awesome. I think I will discard it. Okay, so she is going to affect the king's mood. More happy. And he's like super duper happy now. So uh, so we're going to lay out new cards and then we'll be right back. All right, so we got a couple of new acrobats. This is the ox. The ox says before choosing the travel cards, choose a city. This city is blocked to your opponents this turn. So it's a great way to lock down a location that uh, only you could take advantage of. All right, and then we have the horse. What's the horse do? During the travel phase, play two cards instead of one. Yeah, very powerful again. And then uh, another chameleon that's down there. So we're going to choose our cards and we'll be right back. All right, so Carmen, you chose... Four. Number four. And Green chose... Eight. Number eight. Unfortunately for Carmen, my MP player was number four as well. Ugh, that's why I wanted to go there so bad, but when I drew, when that, I saw that, that and I saw stinks. it was four, it does, because all those are just going to go away. That's so unfair, because yeah. you got something really good. Yes, I did. I got six, um, which means I will get the horse. So, <laughs> yeah, I was after that horse. I think he's a good one, so. I felt like I had to go there, because I couldn't let you go, oh, you know? It is such a good one. So we do work down. 
uh, come to here where Carmen and the uh, MP player are. Now, in this case, Carmen is with another player, so it will change the king's mood. Mm -hmm. So both of these will go up here. Carmen will draw a secret location yeah. or a secret request card. And uh, now what ends up happening, all these cards get discarded and they, they affect the king's mood. So we do go five tragedy. We will go three back. So that'll make it just two tragedy. And then three, three towards the tragedy. So it will go three towards the tragedy. So the king has decided, nah, happy plays aren't my bag. We're going to go one, two, three. I want... Now the king wants to cry. I want somebody to die. <laughs> All right. So let's... Uh, Oh, I'm sorry. I almost forgot to finish this round. Mm. Um, I do collect the horse, which is going to work great with my turtle, because then I can select my cards afterwards. That's going to be awesome. And then the chameleon. Okay. Gets discarded. And then check this out. This is going to have four cards here now. So let's put out our next set of cards. And uh, the season will end when we run out of cards in this deck, and then we will shuffle them all together, and we will do it again. Put another one there there and then two more we got another chameleon out and then can you put the bunny down there thank you sweetheart so we got two more chameleons out this round okay we're going to select our cards and we'll be right back all right let's see where carmen's going carmen is what is that number three, three. and then seven. seven. Ugh, crap i chose seven myself that is twice now that that's happened to me with oh. her stupid mp player and this guy's going to six so Carmen, you got, oh, <laughs> you got a lot. Yeah. Yeah. And I just, gosh, that's twice that's happened to me. I know where I wanted to go, but I assumed you were going there, so I didn't try. And I, now I wish I had, of course. Well, I wanted to go to here. Yeah. But I didn't because I assumed you were going to go. So I was like, eh, forget well, that's it. that's why I didn't. Yeah. Because, see, I either wanted this one or this one, mm -hmm. but you've already been to this one. I wanted either one of these. Um, and I chose, well, I, I went up there instead because I thought, well, that nobody's going to pick that. Well, I thought. <laughs> All right, so, Carmen. I actually thought of that when I saw they were seven. I was like, ha, ha, ha. Okay. <laughs> so we start from the bottom, no action. This is going to allow you to take back all your carvels and also your cards. Sweet. Your, your discarded cards. Do that again. Mm-hmm. Okay. And then take those back. And then she also gets to send one of her managers to the theater. Do? Where did this come from? It came from right here on six. Or well, wait a minute, it came from here, right? Give me the wrong one. <laughs> Did I? Yeah. Did, was it there? I think it was there. Okay. <laughs> I'll check to make sure. Anyways, uh, you get to send one of your managers to the theater. So uh, <laughs> basically the way this works is that you send a manager to the theater, and then you gain a coin for however many managers are there. So she sent one, so they'll get one money. The next manager that goes to the theater will get two money. Each time the king's mood changes, all managers come back. So, all right, so let's uh, keep working. Now I've got to decide if I'm going to discard Oh, one yeah, of these. yeah. She can only choose one of them if she chooses to discard any. So she's got one happy and she's got two tragedies. So, and it is already a tragedy play. So, yeah, it's kind of difficult. Mm hmm. Well, while she's thinking of that, we will discard him and then this will go away. And then we do discard these. Now, this is going to affect this even more of a tragedy play, so keep that in mind, because it is going to go two towards mm. tragedy, so I need you to make up your mind on what you're doing before I, I do anything, so. And then I will get a secret request as well. Um, I'll discard the happy one. Okay, so, let me put this down here, I'm sorry, I got confused for a second. You discarded the happy, which... It, what was it, the number? Four. Okay, so we're going to go four. So one, two, three, four. Mm -hmm. That does affect the king's mood. So now it goes back to a happy. Back. That comes back. Then I discarded a two. And now it's going to go back two. So one, two. So, all right. Now we're going to put new cards out, and then we'll be right back. All right, so all the new cards are out, and we did get a new acrobat out. This is the box. So, when multiple players have chosen the same city, change the king's mood in the opposite direction. Ooh, that could be really cool. Okay, so um, I am going to use my acrobats this round, So, because I keep getting screwed and picking the same card. So, I'm going to use the turtle. So, it says, during the travel phase, choose the card after the other players have chosen theirs. 
And I'm going to combine that with the horse. During the travel phase, play two cards instead of one. So I'll be able to travel to two locations, and I'm going to know where I'm going after everybody else chooses theirs. All right, so Carmen, you are going to five, and he's going to two. <laughs> he is Figures going time. to seven, and seven. put him at seven. And now I get to choose my two destinations. So hang on, I'm going to think about Sweet. this. Okay, so I chose one and four. So I'm not 100% sure on this because it doesn't say plural. During your travel phase, choose your card after the other players. It says card. It doesn't say cards. You would have thought they'd have added the yes just in case if you would combine it with the ability of the horse. And I am pretty sure you could play two acrobats on the same turn so and uh, combine their powers. So And then I went four as well. So All right, so we start at one. So I did gain another couple of actors. So let's see what I've got here. So I can send a manager to the, uh, the theater. So I'm going to send him on up there. And that will now give me one coin for that. Okay. Next, uh, I will get back all my discarded cards and all my carvels, which I'll do that off camera. It's not necessary for me to do it on camera. Uh, and then I do gain this ox, and he will allow me to block a city of my choice. And I'll play him just right there. So if I wanted to, I could decide if I wanted to uh, discard one of these guys to be able to um, change the king's mood. Hmm, man, that's a tough choice. I think I will. I am going to discard this number three, and I am going to change the king's mood. So we're going to go one, two, three, and now it's going to go back to a sad play again, and I get back my manager. All right, so now uh, we'll go to the number two spot. All of these just go away. Ooh, oh, that really that, stinks. It affects the king. No, it doesn't. No, it does not. He's oh. by himself. Yeah. I, I was counting on it affecting him. Uh, now we're going to go here, and I do gain the chameleon, and uh, get back all my cards again, which that's you know already going to happen, so no big deal. Okay, and I will not discard him. I'll keep a hold of him. All right, so now it goes to Carmen. Carmen, what you doing? I'm going to keep all this. I get four coins and, and an, actor. an actor. Okay, so put your carvel up there. And then last but not least, we're just going to discard Zibonea. And we'll put that carvel up there. All right, and then we'll come back. We'll have new cards out. All right, so I used my ox, and I have blocked off the eight space, so nobody was allowed to go to the eight space. Which so. is exactly the space I was going to choose. Well, it's it's a great <laughs> space, so obviously that you guys know where I'm going. I'm going to the eight space. <laughs> wow, bless you, sweetheart. You <laughs> Let it all out. And then uh, he is going to go to the two space. And then where are you going, sweetheart? Oh, um, four. Four, and then where's he going? You're all uh, frazzled from your big giant sneeze, aren't yes. you? Yes. And then a one. Because mm. I'm wondering if you're allowed to go there and to use the ox. What does the ox It says say? to all other players. Oh, okay. So it's very specific. <laughs> so this will be discarded. This will be discarded. Both of them guys head up to there. Wait. Yes. I picked the wrong number. I picked four because of that being right there. Oh, you wanted to go six. I wanted and to go I don't six. think it would have mattered, so go ahead and place your six. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, it, it wouldn't have mattered. They weren't going there I'm anyway, so. sneezing and being blocked off, and all kinds of things are happening. And I'm just frazzled, okay? It's a bad <laughs> day! So, uh, do you want to keep him, or are you going to discard him? Oh, gosh, I am not sure. Let me get my coins first. Well, you're you're on a tragedy play right now, so so if you discard him, you're going to affect to be a happy play, yeah. which means you're not going to get the money for them. So, technically, it would be a bad idea to uh, discard him. Um, next, uh, we go down to me, and if you could just hand me those three cards, I'd appreciate it. Thank you. Okay. Now you're going to mess it up. <laughs> so what happens now is that I'm going to send uh, two managers to the theater. So let's send two managers. So I'm going to get one coin for the first one, and then two coins for the second. So that's three total coins. Thank you. Next, um, I will steal a coin from Carmen. That's really not cool, man. I don't know. That's a, he's a thieving little happy bunny. And uh, I am not going to discard one either. And the reason is is because of my secret cards, uh, my secret oh. request card. And I've kind of did what I needed to do, and I don't want to mess that up. So, All right, so now we are at the end of the season. So we're going to go over the end of the season uh, rules, and we'll be right back. 
All right, so Carmen had to go get herself all sneezified, so uh, <laughs> she's back. All right, so uh, we are at a tragedy play. That's we're all set up, and what we're going to do now is that at the end of the season, we're going to gain one coin for each actor that matches the king's mood. I have three actors here that are tragedian, tragedians, so I will gain three coins, and Carmen will gain three coins as well. <laughs> now, chameleons do not count. They can alter... The, uh, they can play as a tragedian, tragedian or a comedian. They do not count as an actor. They're an acrobat, though. Okay. Mm -hmm. The next thing that we're going to get is if the show pleases the king, you will gain three EQs this season. Next season will be five. Um, now, the way your show will please the king is by the experience of your actors. So I have one, two, three, four, five, six, six experienced happy actors. And then I have four, five, six, seven, eight. And I'll count him as a tragedian. <laughs> so that'll be nine. Um, I also have nine. And, and you have a nine as well. So mm -hmm. um, so that's a difference of uh, three. So I'm three tragedian is what I, I am, basically. That's the difference. So my show pleased the king. Carmen, did your show please the king? Yes. yes and you have four, five. So Carmen... It's five. Mm -hmm. Because... So we subtract her four from that four, so that leaves her with three, four. He could count, so that's five. So Carmen's show, though... Even though we both please the king, she really pleased the king. The so king she gets more. double the amount. So I get three and she will gain six. All right. Uh, the next thing we are going to do is we are going to see if uh, we could possibly um, play one of our secret request cards. So I have two secret request cards and I can play one face up and it will stay there and it could possibly even give me money at the next one. So I'm going to play this one right here. And this is the Master of Protocol. Gain six money if you have an equal number of comedians and tradians in your troop. I do. I have three of each, so I'm going to gain six more coins. Carmen, are you going to play one? Um, gain one EQ for each acrobat in your troop. So you will gain one money. Wow, have, I would have one. loved that one. I, I would have gained four. That stinks. But I still gained six. So All right, so now what happens is, is that we're going to take all of our actors. Now, we keep our... Um, we keep our acrobats. They never go away. But all actors will go back into the deck, and we're going to set up for a second season. Now, we will flip a coin, and we're going to see about changing the king's mood, and we're going to get back all of our stuff, uh, like our managers and stuff like that. Now, we will not get back our, our cards or anything until we're down to just one card left in our hand. Then we're going to get them back. So that'll happen right on the first round of the next round. All right, so we're at the start of the second season. Now, the King's Mood did change, so I was able to get back my uh, managers. And the way that that happens is, is that you flip one of these little coins, and if you notice, he's a happy Lion King on this side. And he's a sad Lion King on that side. And uh, that determines what his mood will be. So, all right, we got all, all our cards set back out again, and then Carmen and I are going to choose our locations, and we'll be right back. All right, so I have chosen one. The My MP person has chosen three. Carmen has chosen eight. And her guy has chosen four. So we all went to a good a, a location that we're going to be able to actually do I was going to go to four, but, you know, he has to take it. I was actually going to go to four. I'm glad I changed my mind, to be honest, because that, that is a bummer when you don't get anything out. Well, the secret request cards are pretty powerful. Now, he's down to one card, which means he's going to get all his carvels and his discarded cards back. So starting with me, um, I will get this happy bunny. Almost went there. And that's going to give me all my stuff yeah, back. Yeah, that's so, why. Well, yeah, I figured I might as well just okay. do it. Um, so give me that. Thank you. And uh, that's it for me. So now he's going to go up here, discard and he's going to discard that actor. Uh, it's going to go up there, discard this acrobat, and then Carmen went to eight, which means she's just going to get money. two points. Money, 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 Mr. Krabs. <laughs> money, 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 money. <laughs> I just right. figure it's instant money, why not? Well, it's instant points. Now, your guy and my guy will be getting all their cards and their carvels back. So we're going to collect those, put out new cards, and we'll be right back. All right, so I have chosen five. He has chosen one. Carmen has chosen seven and eight. Okay, everybody's going to get some good stuff again. So, all right. So, and then he'll go on one. So, he's going to basically just destroy this. Destroy the bunny. Poor bunny. Yeah, poor bunny. He died destroyed. Uh, so, I'm going to send a manager to the theater. Uh -huh. Hello. And then I get a coin for that. Thank you very much. 
All right. And then uh, I also get two more coins. Yeah. So that wasn't too shabby, was it? Are you going to keep that or discard it? I'm going to keep him. Okay. Yay. All right, Carmen. And then what happens to you? Mm, I send a manager. All right. That's going to get you two, two coins. coins. Rock and roll. Me. Okay. And then I can decide if I want to discard one of these or not to make him more sad. And if you do that, we'll get back our managers, which is good and bad because right now we're going to be starting to make some money off of it. Let's she did that. it. So she did change the mood. So one, two, three. And both her and I are going to get back our managers. So, all right. And then he'll just discard that one. So, perfectly well, good card. Yeah, it was wasted. a good one. Three money. All right. So, we'll be right back with the next round. All right. So, Carmen, where did you choose you wanted to go? Four. Four. Where is he going? Seven. Seven. And he is going to go to two. I was going to go there. I really wanted uh, all that. I hate that. Yeah, and then I'm going to go to three. So. Yay! Everybody got good stuff, so all this is just going to go away. Stupid empty player. <laughs> and then, uh, so I have to pay one coin for this actor, so he's a level five. He is so experienced, and I do get still a coin, though, for Carmen. So, in a way, Carmen paid for I my level for five actor. actor. <laughs> Thank you, honey. It was really nice of you. And then we'll put both of these up here. I didn't want to be nice. Yes, you do. Okay. All right, Carmen, you get the stag. Yay. So what's the stag do again? During the resolution phase, you can discard an extra actor to change the king's Ooh. mood. And then uh, she's also going to get back her discarded cards and her carvels. So go ahead and take back your carvels and your discarded cards. All right, and then uh, this will just be discarded. Give me my bunny. <laughs> what? What? Oh, your okay. actor. <laughs> so we're going to put new cards out and we'll be right back. I didn't know what you was talking about. <laughs> All right, so I've decided to use my ox to block off that area. You shall not pass! And uh, I've also used my turtle and my horse. So I'm going to choose my cards after Carmen has revealed and then I get to play two. So Carmen, you're going to go to number, what is that, five or six? Five. I'm sorry. Five and then number two. And then he is going to go to... Number seven, which is up here. And now I get to choose mine, which obviously I'm gonna do the six. And let me think about my second one. I'll be right back. All right, so I chose six and eight, so we're gonna go six and then eight. Oh no. <sighs> All right, so uh, this is the NP player, so he basically just He's gets- He's getting way too much this round. And then Carmen, you get a chameleon. Yes. And then you're also going to send one of your chicken managers. Which is going to give you a coin. <laughs> yeah, I guess it will. Oh, yeah, you will. You will get All right, it. I'm going to discard that. Uh, so you're going to make it even more tragic of a play. Mm -hmm. So, okay. So, one, two, three. Super sad play. It's the <laughs> saddle meter went up higher. So uh, I will steal a coin from you. That's the coin. So you sent your manager to go get me a coin. <laughs> I will gain an additional coin. So three d additional coins. And you stole my rooster. And Take I stole your, your rooster. Stupid rooster. And the rooster, uh, before totaling the coups, you can discard one of your actors without changing the king's mood. So this is really cool. Um, this will happen at the end of the season. All right. So I those two go just away because they were just coins. And then I get my happy bunny. So he'll go here. Now I could discard him if I wanted to to make it. But I don't want to. So uh, that'll get discarded. Mm -hmm. And then I will send another manager to there. Which gives you another coin for my manager so going two up coins. there. Oops, sorry, sweetie. I'm Thank throwing you. them around because I'm angry. These are my angry eyes. <laughs> so we are going to do that and do that as well. So hmm, I've got an interesting play going on here. So I've got... 9, 10, 11, 12, sad, and then 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, happy. So, is that right? Yeah, so I'm definitely still a tragedy play, so I may not worry about uh, discarding an actor yet um, to try to affect the mood. So, I'll just hang on to them for right now is what I'm getting at. So, all right, uh, we're going to put out a new row of cards. There's only two more rounds before the end of the game tally. All right, Carmen, where are you going, hun? One. You blocked me, didn't you? Yeah, it probably was a bad move. Four. He is going to. Three. Doop. 
And unfortunately, honey, I went to one as well. Oh, no, I went... You went to four. Oh, crap. What did I what do? Did I do? grabbed the wrong one, I think, on accident. I meant to do one. Oh, well, we'll just stick with it. So I went to four as well. So, all right. So, Carmen... Oh, did you grab it four because of that four I, being I think right I there? did. I And that's... that's what's what funny is... Earlier. All of us have done this. In every game I've played, all of us have looked at these silly numbers instead, instead of, of that right there. And it's my own fault. I meant oh, to grab the one. should be like letters of the alphabet. <laughs> it's no big deal. I'll just stick with what happened. All right. So, Carmen, um, you get to steal a coin. Yay. You can give you, me a gold one if you want. I'd rather not. Uh, you get all your carvels and all your discarded cards back. Yay. Now, do you want to discard any of these cards? Keep in mind, I am going to... Have drastically change this to happy seven points so if you don't do that it's going to end up being a happy play so seven how, how are you oh because i am there with the mp it. player on accident i did not mean to do that all right i will discard both of these and nope change you it. can only do one the stag You're during the resolution the phase you, you can discard an extra actor so, you, so how much are you affecting it then by six six so that will put it all the way. Maximum. Maximum sadness. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Then you go up there. Uh, King wants his angst. <laughs> all right. So basically these are going to be discarded and it will go seven points back to happiness. If you can do that, that'd be great, please. And then I do get another secret agenda request card. So <laughs> yeah, yeah, boy, that's going to happen. Look at my secret request. If I have no acrobats, I know. It's like, that's what I got last yeah, game. And I was that's like, I not have gonna one. happen. It's too late. <laughs> All right, Jeez. so there's not a lot of cards. We just play one more round, and we can't even fill up the entire thing here. There's only three cards, so uh, but we do play this one, and uh, we'll select our cards, and we'll be right back. All right, Carmen, where did you go, sweetie? I went to two. Two. Where did he go? Five. Five. And unfortunately for you, sweetheart, I went to two. Oh yeah. no. And he went to five. <laughs> oh, <laughs> That's kind it. of funny, isn't it? So who uh, first? So, well, you can go ahead and take one. It don't matter. Anyways, uh, so this will affect the, the King's Mood 2 tragedy is, again. So this will go super tragedy. Choop, choop. All right. We go up there. And we both do get a secret request. This is going to go up there. Yeah, the bear goes away. Useless. Well, my last one was absolutely it's useless, so... Gain one EQ for each actor of experience three in your troop. <laughs> <laughs> all right, so now what we're doing is uh, all this stuff can now go away, and we're going to go to the end of the season, and we're going to add up uh, our points. So first off, what we're going to do is uh, we are going to get points for our actors that match the king's mood. So he is a sad... Uh, King Mood, mm -hmm. so we are going to get one point for each one of our actors that are in a set. So I get three points for that. Carmen got two points, it looks like. Mm -hmm. All right, so one, two, three. Next, um, we are going to see if our show pleased the king. So what I am going to do is I'm going to use my rooster now. And uh, before totaling the EQs, you can, which, hmm, okay, so I probably should have done that right before this. So before totaling the EQs, you can discard one of your actors without changing, changing the king's mood. Going to do that, and then I'm going to get rid of my number three happy bunny, so that. Bye bye happy bunny. I now have an even troop as well. All right, so uh, now I have a five, six, seven, eight, uh, twelve, thirteen, minus one, two, three, four, five. So I have an eight sad play. Oh man, I have a six. I... You have a six sad you play, which me. means that at the end of this season you get five. It'll be double. So I'm going to get ten coins for pleasing the king and putting on the best sad show. Wow. Now we are going to play our. Uh, well, let me think. Uh, it's our uh, the uh, the secret requests. I'm sorry, I, I didn't mean to stumble. So we do get this one that we already played, and then I gained luckily with that last one that uh, I played. Yeah. Figures. The last one I drew, where'd it go? This one. Gain three EQs if you present the best show, which I did. So I'm wow. gonna gain a three, total of nine, counting both of those. So nine more coins. You are banking. I am, I'm banking Lincoln. And we'll put that back. Mm -hmm. All right, so now Carmen and I total our coins. We'll see who won, we'll be right back. So at the end of the game, I ended with five gold doubloons, 50 coins, and Carmen, 
Uh, I, I shouldn't have discarded two actors. I don't know if that would have helped, but I had 36. Well, 36, yeah, those two actors would have made a difference. That is true, because you maybe put on the best show, which that could have prevented me from the three yeah. plus the doubling. That's a big deal, because that was seven so, points value. Eight. It was eight. Oh, mm -hmm. that won me the game, didn't it? Hey, well, uh, that's uh, history -o. I hope you guys enjoyed that. Woo! Finally, 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 finally. It has been like a full month since I've beaten you in a live playthrough, and it's about to get to... And even in our last playthrough, I tied you. So it's like, it's not a victory. This was a solid victory for the uh, for the guy team. Guy I, team! I, I should have quit when I was ahead. No, you should have quit right after our Star Wars Rebellion live playthrough yeah. and that incredible comeback. That would have been, <laughs> been a good place to retire. <laughs> but man, all week I've been like, tie the tiger, man. I... I just had to win this, man. Uh, <laughs> it's just that important. So we hope you guys got a great understand, an understanding on how history will plays. And uh, let's talk a little bit about this game we just did finish up. Mm -hmm. Now, I felt like at the end of the first season, you were uh, further ahead of me in coins I and was, victory points. I was further ahead of you like by five yeah, in coins. Yeah, but at the same time, I felt like early season, the first season, I was playing the long game the entire time. Yeah. Trying to gobble up as many acrobats that I felt like I, were going to allow me to I get... I just kept grabbing coins in the first season mm -hmm. because they're right there. You're immediately... And you know it's a victory gratified. point. Gratified. You know it's a victory point. There's no chance. Right. You know? Because I feel like if I grab actors, they, know, they might be a victory point. They might not be. And mm -hmm. um, obviously that didn't work out very well for yeah. me. Yeah. <laughs> and those acrobats, you really... You, you just can't underestimate them. They are so powerful and they allow you to just really just... To mm -hmm. have so much freedom to do whatever you want to do in a round. And then after he grabs up all the acrobats, my secret, what do, what do you call that? Secret agenda or secret request. Secret request mm -hmm. card was uh, a bonus for acrobats. Yeah. It was kind of too late for me at that point. I mean, I, I still got like three, but that's, you know. And, well, and some acrobats are obviously better than other acrobats. I mean, the horse card is phenomenal. The turtle card, phenomenal. The ox the card, ox. phenomenal. Wow. They're so yeah. good. And then some of the other ones, like the fox, that it's just like, well, you know, you could, uh, you know, uh, instead of it being happy, it could be sad. Eh, I don't know. I mean, that's... So circumstantial. Mm -hmm. Whereas the other ones you know are going to come into play. Right. So that's where you know, and even the rooster, where you don't know if he's going to be beneficial. Yeah. The others you know for a fact will. But the, so the acrobats, you, some of them you know for a fact are going to benefit you the same as I knew for a fact grabbing coins was going to benefit me. So, <laughs> yeah, I, I should have grabbed some more acrobats. <laughs> yeah, yeah, lesson learned. So uh, we hope you guys enjoyed this. I hope it gave a great understanding of history -o. And we uh, got some other games in the work, but we don't want to necessarily either uh, give our opinion of this one because we're going to do our in a, end of the month roundup next week. So check that out. And then we'll also tell you what games are going to be coming out for the month of... June. June. Yes. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.